And also, y'all, like, when you repent to God and then you repent to that person for being, like, dishonorable, like, maybe, like, 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 I had quit a job one time and I did not give them two weeks notice and I literally had a shift the next day. Um, and it wasn't even about me giving two weeks notice. It was just the way I went about it was so, like, it just wasn't, it was just dishonorable. So I texted the lady and I was just like, I, my, my old boss, I texted her and I was just like, I really apologize. Like, I'm so sorry. And when you are honest like that about your own shortcomings and when you're honest about you know what you did <clears throat> what you said or whatever like it's just so honorable to God you know what I mean it's so honorable to God I know he's in heaven like smiling like that's my baby because it's just like I'm, like I think about like when your dog I don't have any kids but think about like, like, like when my dog is a good girl and she waits at that door for me to let her out and she goes outside and she pees and she looks back I'm like that's my baby like that's my baby like, you can have whatever you want she can't she can't have whatever she wants but um I'm so proud of her. And, like, she's a little dog. Like, imagine how God feels when we're, like, I'm so sorry. Like, I literally have been such a trifling employee. Or I'm so sorry. I'm such a horrible daughter. Or I'm so sorry. I was such a horrible friend to you. Right? Like, it says so much about your character and how your character is developing for you to not only acknowledge your shortcomings before God, but to acknowledge your shortcomings before Man, like before people that God put in place to bless you, it's different if it's somebody that God had, did not put there. Now, if God put that person there to bless you, it's a different story. This is not mean you go to your ex who you should have never even known and talk to them. Mm -mm. Y'all are no contact for a reason. But like an old boss or like an old friend, you know, somebody that was good to you and you repaid them with evil, there's something where it's like in Proverbs where it's like, cursed is the person that repays evil that repays good for evil. I'll find the scripture. I'll put it in the caption. But like when you go to that person and you genuinely humble yourself before them and you are honest about your shortcomings, like that is so beautiful and it's so honorable. And I'm telling you, like God is going to bless you for that because it says in Proverbs, God resists the proud. But then it also says he lifts the humble. Like, hello. So when you are genuine and like, you're like, you know, girl, I messed up. You know what, boss? I messed up. You know what, friend? I have not been a good friend to you. And you like genuinely go back and try and do better. God, not only will God help you do better, but he will bless you in other ways. And I'm just, I just believe in that. Bye.